Pin AI. Hey there, welcome to my Pin AI review. In this video, we're going to take a look at a demo of Pin AI, take a look in the members area to see exactly how it works, and to let you know my thoughts on this strategy. My name is Adam from Web Traffic Toolkit. I earn a full time income on the internet with digital marketing. I've been doing this for over 10 years now, which is really cool. So, hopefully, my thoughts on Pin AI. Pin AI, taken from all that experience doing internet marketing, will help you as you do your research. Before we dive into this Pin AI review, if you check out the link below, click the link in the video description below, you can discover my number one recommended online system right now. It's a complete done for you system and a really excellent way to get going, building up that realistic income on the internet. So check out the link below for my number one recommended online system. So Pin AI, this is a sneak peek inside the members area. And there's basically a number of steps that you go through to create posts that you post onto the Pinterest social media platform. And the aim is to replicate existing posts that are already doing well on the platform, use that as a template to create your own posts, and then try and get traffic from um, your Pinterest posts to a landing page where you can then promote affiliate products in return for commissions. So they have a seven step process here. The first process is to create the campaign. Step two is pin finder, which is basically researching other existing Pinterest posts out there that are already doing well. So you type in the keyword to see which posts are already on Pinterest so you can model your own post based on existing pins. Templates is basically where you can import other people's pins or import your own template into the image editor and you can manu manually edit the image from the built-in image editor to create your Pinterest post. And it's already pre-programmed to the sort of Pinterest image size um, that they want to see on the platform. So that's a cool way of using other people's pins as a template to base your own pins off. Then you've got AI hashtags, and that's basically researching the main hashtags on Pinterest that are doing well for certain niches. I'm skeptical how AI comes into it. It basically just pulls out Pinterest hashtags that are already on the platform, and same with AI tags to optimize the post. Then the landing page, they've got built-in landing page templates you can use. These are kind of like squeeze pages where someone can enter in their email address and you can build your email list. <clears throat> and then finally, you can actually post the, the Pinterest pins within Pin AI. You can hook it up to the API of Pinterest and schedule pins um, from within the Pin AI members area. So it's a complete A to Z process of researching pins, creating the hashtags, creating the image, and uploading it to Pinterest and also creating a landing page. They've also got a hot offers section here. So if you're not sure what affiliate offers to promote, you can take a look at some affiliate offers on proven networks to see um, what done for you affiliate offers they are recommending you can promote um, within the Pin AI members area. So they cover quite a lot in the members area. So the first stage of Pin AI is basically to type in a keyword to see which Pinterest pins are doing well for that particular keyword. I'm skeptical on the type of data they pull from Pinterest. It seems they're just using the keyword to scrape other posts that contain that keyword. I don't know in terms of how they decide which the popular posts or whether they're just searching the keyword itself. So I'm not sure how they get the data and if they're organizing it in the best way, but at least gives you an example of what other, other people are posting um, using certain keywords. And then you can click on these images, save it to your file and then re-upload it into this template design section where you can use the existing pin to manually edit it um, to create your own unique post using your own um, graphical design and that they give you here, but at least you've got a proven pin template to base your image on. Then you move on to the AI hashtags. Again, you type in your keyword that you want to target for your pin and AI, supposedly AI will create you a number of recommended tags within that niche. They give you loads of tags here. That seems a bit much for me. So maybe it would be better to pick four or five tags per post, depending on what specific topic you are targeting. Um, I'm skeptical on the way AI comes into these tags. It just seems to be some sort of software that scrapes tags related to your keywords. So I don't know how much AI comes into it or, or what method they use, but it's just an interesting way, a quick and easy way to get some tags to use. And 
then they move on to the landing pages you can create landing page templates and you can also search offers um, to promote within the pin ai members area um, so these are some landing page template designs they're basically quite simple squeeze pages where someone can enter in their email address and request um, an ebook or a free gift or report you're offering or simply discover your system that you're promoting and they'll be redirected to your affiliate offer and then finally they have this affiliate offer section where you can search Warrior Plus or CPA networks for recommended affiliate products to promote within your target marketplace. So overall with PIN AI, I like the A to Z approach of researching popular pins, using that as a template to create your own pin and then uploading it and scheduling it within the members area and also the ability to get hashtags. And um, what I'm skeptical on is how much of this research you could potentially do yourself by just logging onto Pinterest with your own account, browsing popular accounts and pins in your area, and then manually taking a note of the hashtags they're using, manually taking a note of what the images look like, going to your own editor and creating similar posts and similar hashtags based on your own research. So I'm skeptical this all needs to be packaged into one members area. You could probably do a lot of this with your own manual research on Pinterest. However, the way they package it in nicely into one members area as part of Pin AI will be suitable for newbies to go through the step-by-step -step A to Z approach. And it's just a bit of a time saver to have all the different tools within the members area of Pin AI. But you could probably replicate the same sort of research um, and template and pin creation approach with your own research and maybe you may even get better data on just seeing what's trending right here right now rather than relying on a software tool just to scrape from the keywords you enter um, but there's definitely um, some cool advantages of pin ai to use this social media platform to promote affiliate products for commissions if you want to discover how I go about earning a full-time income online, primarily with affiliate marketing using traffic generation and list building, and how I've been doing this for over 10 years now with a proven method, then click the link below. Click the link in the video description for my number one recommended online system. It's a complete done for you system, and it's a really excellent way to get your own traffic, your own email list, and build up that realistic income online. So click the link below for my number one online system. Thanks again for checking out my PIN AI review. All the best and speak soon.